Hello everyone, this is Jason from Primetime Aquatics and in this video I wanted to share with you a money saving tip that we have been using for many years and that is where do you buy aquarium salt? Now some of you may know that aquarium salt can be so useful. You can use it to make live baby brine shrimp and we do that twice a day. You can use it to treat disease. You can use it as a preventative. Aquarium salt is a definite thing you want to have if you're keeping fish tanks. The problem is, while it's not super expensive, you go on the internet or to the store and all of a sudden you're looking at six, seven, eight dollars for a little three or four pound container. Now it doesn't sound like a lot, but as you use it, if you've got more tanks or larger tanks, that cost can add up. So what do we do? How do we save money, especially with 70 tanks, with hatching out live baby brine twice a day if we have to treat disease? Salt is a huge part of that. Let me share with you a little secret. Whoa, okay, this, this, this is what we do. This is the Diamond Crystals Solar Natural Water Softener Salt. Now this is pure salt. There are no binders in here. There are no chemicals in here. It is just salt. Now I mentioned, if you were to go on Amazon right now and you were to look at the cost of aquarium salt, you're probably looking at about $7 for four pounds. This bag here is 40 pounds. Would you like to take a guess how much it cost? $7. That's right, $7. Now, now we get this at the big box home improvement stores. You could go to Home Depot, you could go to Lowe's in the United States, and you'll most likely find it there. If you wanted to go online, it is there, and I will link it down in the description below, but it is far more expensive because you have to pay to ship 40 pounds of stuff. So even there, you're looking at 40 pounds for like $35 or $36, which is still better than buying aquarium salt. But trust me, just go to a store. This is awesome. This 40 pounds lasts us a long time. Again, the nice thing is, if you've got a water softener, you can still use it there. Super important, if you're going to use this little tip, I highly recommend make sure you're dealing with pure salt and there's no fillers in there and there's no binders. There's no anti-caking agents or anti-fungal agents. And that's why I really recommend this. this is, again, this is Solar, solar Naturals. Super awesome. We've been using it a very long time, have never had an issue. And again, I just wanted to bring you some money saving tips because I know right now with everything going on, it's nice to still enjoy the aquarium hobby, but not have to spend a lot of money. I hope you found this video useful. And if you did, share, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one.